This is Updater Analytics uh, version 9 launched in February 2017 running on the new dual uh, direct desktop API and it's really really powerful. The first thing um, to notice is just how well these applications now run together. They're linked together so from dual you can select update a chart just by right hand clicking on the menu and that chart will appear in updater and you'll notice it's super quick. I just literally go there update a chart on any instrument within your dual uh, screen straight away you get the history and analytics in updater. So that makes it super super fast and uh, of course then all the data sets are available to you uh, again so quick you barely see it that's 60 minute daily data 60 minute all the intraday series there ready for you to analyze so it really really is powerful um, of course Updata comes with the most advanced analytics tool set that you'll you'll find anywhere um, and so the key thing is um, that Updata now runs on both the old dual trading gateway system um, or the new dual direct system and the big advantage with dual direct is that all the codes are the same um, so the mappings uh, are the same so dual direct users will be able to run the same workspaces uh, and email these workspaces between each other um, really really powerful for for that so just in your trading screen trading platforms in the updater um, icon you just select Trayport dual if you're configuring away from Trayport trading gateway Trayport dual and of course you can add in other terminals like Bloomberg Thomson Reuters icon uh, the whole host of, uh, of data series so really really powerful in that regard and in fact we see here that we've got Thomson Reuters icon running into Updata so I can look at things like my sterling rates here or my um, euro or my exchange data like um, WTI or Brent crude um, comes from uh, the Updata system running on Thomson Reuters. That also means that if you are looking at a, a, a Trayport chart, and just out of interest, uh, with Updater, when you go to type in the code um, on the Dual Direct feed, you basically have this ability now to select um, quite a, a, a lot of different series. So if I if I go to um, front month MBP, these are all the contracts here, but of course Updata has this ability to join these contracts together. So you can have a contiguous or a continuous chart. If we look at the um, continuous chart, uh, this is now really long histories, stretching that data together so that you can do lots of uh, analysis um, and really good for long back tests, etc. So that's um, the 60. Uh, that's the daily data. And again, I can go and open the continuous chart. So if I go back to MBP, go to the uh, front month, um, and so the contiguous chart will have not have joined the um, the history. So basically, uh, this is for those that want to back test without the rollover adjustment. So you can see here in 2009, we have a low of 1750 on the continuous chart. We don't have that because this is rollover adjusted. So Updater has that ability to do that with all your uh, Trayport dual histories, um, making the analysis much easier to analyze that uh, long-term data. So it's a really key aspect of, of the updater system. So um, in, basically the, the great thing is, is that you can mix and match the data. So here we're, we're running uh, uh, Thomson Reuters icon. I can go and grab these uh, Trayport lists just the same. Um, so this data is now coming from Dual Direct. And because these codes all map, these workspaces keep an eye out in our libraries for new um, dual direct workspaces which uh, basically gives you the ability to run exactly the same analysis that I run each day in my charts today um, so you see here we've got these tracker charts weekly daily and 60 minute charts 1% log scale point and figure half a percent log scale and 0.1% 60 minute and I can literally just click around the data and it's really just powerful Powerful. and you'll see how quickly that data is is being requested um, from the Trayport Dual Direct API so much much faster and we can switch to power contracts uh, it's all there just the same so it's really really quick you see we want to see French base load uh, German base load 
really, really powerful. And you may have noticed when we do do this uh, link out, when we go for the updated chart, it brings it in as all venues. So you know that all the venues that have been trading on Trayport for TTF HiCal in this instance, March 17, these are all the venues. So that really is just powerful for your analysis. And then when it comes to doing, says so a 60 minute chart, when it comes to doing things like your targets, you know that this is all the traded data that's producing those targets. So really, really good um, from, from that perspective. Of course, because you can mix and match the data, so here we have a, um, uh, uh, an, uh, the, uh, uh, the, 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 uh, MBP chart. We'll go back and just grab that chart again. You notice how quick these uh, charts are. So this is the continuous chart. All the rollover adjusted expired contracts joined together. And if I want to see the correlation, this is the daily. If I go for the 60 minute chart of an MBP and I want to see, say, the correlation between this and crude oil, really great because I can now just go to Thomson Reuters icon, just click on the icon tab type in my code, it remembers the code, so it's already got the fact that I've opened the Brent crew, and we're going to do a 65 hour correlation here, and that's what it looks like. So this is your MVP um, data uh, and Thomson Reuters data married together. So really great for mixing and matching uh, the data sets. And of course that also applies for things like your spreads. So if you want to do energy spreads like your own sparks, darks, cracks, in fact any formula you can think of, you can just literally pull the data in from Thomson Reuters icon for your currencies, for your crude, and then from OTC data off Trayport Jewel for things like your coal, um, gas and power contracts. So the ability to mix and match these data sets to get real-time spreads uh, is really, really valuable for a lot of our users. So um, that's just another aspect of, of using Updata. Of course, you get all the analysis tools out of the box, loads and loads of technical analysis tools, uh, we, scanning and alerts, whole series of different ways of looking at the data. So for example, um, we've got various different screens here, um, composite screens that you might be used to seeing, forward curves, all of the forward curves handled, uh, so lots of different screen types available to you in the quotes menu. Scanning and alerting, uh, so you can set for pattern types that you're looking for. You can run reports, create your own reports with all this data in, and we'll have more and more of those reports coming into the library. And then, of course, the custom coding and analytics. And in our libraries, there's over uh, 1,000 different custom indicators and uh, trading and uh, trading uh, solutions so or trading strategy so really key there and here we're just opening up there's as hundreds and hundreds of these pre-written scans and you can see what these look like when you just go and hover over the different uh, indicator types and the same is true of custom libraries so here lots of different trading systems and we'll even write trading systems for you so there's energy trading systems systems from stocks and commodities and again you can um, download these systems straight away or we'll write them for you so this is a whole new dawn in updater um, for Trayport users, really great um, that you can now just link out straight away out of Trayport, just click that updater chart and it will draw it for you in Updata and it's just super quick and super fast for you to manipulate and analyze the data. And of course these all update and uh, automatically from your Trayport system. So why not give us a call or email us at ta.updata.co.uk to arrange a, a trial running on your Trayport screen and we'd be very happy to help.